Crazy. Nah, you win. You win this round. I have cast so many sets with John. <laughs> Immediately trading projectiles. Draw. <laughs> Pew. Yeah, John Numbers coming out on top. The sun making its way through the laser. Deep breathing up. John Numbers at ledge. It's Wednesday at Xeno. And it's raining. Is it? Yeah. Uh -oh. Well, it was raining a little earlier. Oh. And we are projected to have rain tonight. So you know what? This is John's moment to shine. Oh, the down smash is coming out, finding John. And I'm I'm so in between about this weather right now because I, I hate it when it's cold and I love it when it's warm, but when it's in between, it's like, just give it to me. Just give me these warm days. It's really nice. Yeah. I love a good cold day, though. Really? I hate cold days. No. <laughs> oh, okay. But you know what, John? Ooh. Unable to get back. Eats a back air. And LRA starts. This is what I'm talking about. Do not discount LRA starts. John may be our defender, but LRA starts is the underdog. Yeah. Absolutely, and being an underdog, being up, he has to find some extra credit here. Well, Not gonna find it. Underwolf in this case. Uh, uh, oh. Oh, finding the Nair. Looking for the falling up air with it, but couldn't find anything. Oh, good grab by LRA. Finding the up air is John getting pushed out to ledge. Yeah, don't let him deep breathing for free start. Oh! Oh my god! And John trying to make his way back into LRA's recovery. Couldn't do it in time. Start with a stock lead. You know, John is always telling people, like, you got you got to learn from the best. And if there's anything to learn from John, it's to go out and, and spike people. Yeah. You can do it. <laughs> that, that's right. Go for it. Go off stage. It's hype. It, it's absolutely hype. Oh, LRA doing a good job. You know, John came out of that stock hot, found an easy 67, now 72, but start doing a good job of resetting, staying calm, trying to find these neutral wins. John's at 40, couldn't find anything on that down air. Yeah, that shield just looking a little too small and just uh, John was able to poke through it on the head side and LRA just holding strong there, trying to go for another spike. All right. John. Oh, you can't roll there. No, that's a bit of a panic. I yeah. mean, when John is at ledge, like, he can react to almost any option he has. Yeah. Once you see someone to start playing quick like that, you know, it's not bad to try to punish a hard roll in because I feel like when people start playing fast, that's when they're going to roll to get up a lot. Yeah. It's like, oh, you're mashing the shield button? That's a roll. Yeah, <laughs> real. Oh, my gosh. Almost oh, got that up smash. That was almost sick. Dropping through the platform, up air into back air. Sheesh. But not finding enough to convert. John, low profiling, finds the up tilt. Little that actually gave enough time to react to the neutral air. That down smash, almost finding John on the tech roll. If LRA held it a second longer, maybe. Oh. Mm. Oh. oh my gosh. Did and he just F smash? Yeah, in neutral? In neutral? Oh my god. So no Town and City, no PS2, and John, actually a little surprised. Maybe not thinking that that was going to get as close as it did. Yeah, uh, I think he's surprised that he F smashed and it killed. <laughs> because. Uh, oh, what? The bear actually didn't hit Johnny. It was like right inside of him. Yeah. Wait, 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 wait. He must have DI'd that like really, really. Like he must have been dashing back, I think, when he got hit by the F smash. I think that's what it was. Yeah. But anyway, game number two. LRA starts, maybe not going to go for as explosive of a start, just kind of holding the ledge. Yeah. LRA start doing a good job of this early game neutral again. We saw it happen in game one, coming out game two hot, but John, the little nice little dash back into the dash attack, finding LRA start, and we're back to even. Big header comes out, does a lot of damage, but ultimately a trade that sends John to ledge. But this is where John likes to shine, right? At ledge, th this is his hometown. Oh my gosh. Yeah, that was almost crazy. Almost Don't even get me special. start started about John Numbers at ledge. I feel like I do this every week. John Numbers is a reverse ledge trapper. You think that he's at ledge and you're fine, but in reality, you're at ledge and you don't even know it yet. It's one of his best qualities as a player. It's ledgeception. Ledgeception. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yeah, for real. <laughs> And again, that low profile saving John from oh, that bear. Oh, that was a sick uh, sun coming out, finding the start, the kill on LRA start. But yeah, John numbers is at ledge. You land a back air, and all of a sudden the screen hits, and you you got back air the whole time. It just kind of had to blink, and you're like, oh, I'm yeah. dead. Yeah. <laughs> but here we go, really good pressure. LRA start just getting maybe a little too comfortable with those up smashes, and John just holding shield, being like, I'm not going to get scooped. I am safe. Yeah, he definitely but put no in his safe PTO because he was gone fishing for sure on that up smash, but eventually <laughs> finding it. John, have, uh, John goes to like every single tournament here in NYC. His PTO must be like, he can take a year Ooh. off and like he'd be okay. Yeah. <laughs> John getting that up smash. 
one last stock to seal this set and secure his place in winners finals. Yeah. A good job from John this game, you know, hitting these hard punishes, like hitting that up smash on platform, that was pretty crazy. But LRA Start not taking it lying down, doing a good job of locking in, making his way back into the game. Hopefully, where, where, up smash with a hit, I think. Oh, well, try there it. it is. There it is. But it's not going to kill. I feel like that down air on plat could have led to an up smash. But alas, oh. I'm jump. liking this idea of harder hits from LRA. It's mm. like, if I'm not going to find all the hits. I'm going to make the ones I actually hit count. That was a bizarre interaction. Yeah, if we can clip that, I actually want to see what yeah, happens. Yeah, that was really weird. Oh, John looking for the down smash. Not gonna... <laughs> oh, well, we have to talk. Let him know, start. Let him know. Uh-oh. The soccer ball coming out. Keeping start off John, but start doing a great job of hitting these nares off stage. Keep John guessing the oh. footstool. Not enough, but that's a re-grab. And start... You know, it's last stock. You can bring it back. We saw you do it against Raptor. Yeah, John's just another player at the end of the day. Hold strong. Now press forward. All right, but this is kind of where it gets a little difficult. You see that sun come out, and John can just kind of throw that out like a bullet. Oh! Just like that spike. What great timing from John. I know it's technically not a two frame, but still balance. great timing. Finding the spike. John numbers on to winner's finals. Congratulations, John Numbers. You did it again. Another Xeno with John Numbers in Winner's Finals. Yeah, but now he's got to fight Zomba. Zomba finally fighting John for the first time in forever. But yeah, let's look at this weird interaction that you were talking yeah, about. Yeah. I believe that's the second. What the heck was that? Yeah, OK. Maybe if we go back, maybe. Yeah, right there, right like there. Like right there? Yeah, I think okay, so. OK, we're going to kind of slow that down a bit. Oh, oh, it was the header. That's ridiculous. Wait, I still don't see what happened. You didn't see what happened? Okay, we're gonna, we're gonna it go back. It traded? No, 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 no. So, yeah, it was no, the I, header. No, he avoided. Uh, no, he got hit John with the header. Spike. Yeah. All right, we're getting into.